No, I'm fascinated with the liver because I know that it, it's associated with drinking and stuff. Could you tell right away when you see a liver, like, oh, that person drank a lot Absolutely. over their lifetime? And what does that look like? So first, when you drink a lot, you get your liver starts to get replaced by fat, and it gets it actually gets bigger than it normally should get. And it's really cool because sometimes when you open the body, the liver's so big that you could see the impressions from the ribs because it's pushing up against wow. the ribs. It's really Wow. I mean, it's it's not cool for them, obviously, but it's cool scientifically. Um, and then once it, it has it, so fatty liver is considered to be reversible. So if you ever get diagnosed with that, if you stop drinking, it could go back to normal. But once it starts scarring up, it gets this, and then it starts to shrink, and it looks very nodular, and it's it's very striking. You can tell the difference, and it becomes smaller. And you also get associated things with that. You can get hemorrhoids, and if there's any kind of a blockage of the portal system, which is a part of the circulatory system that goes through the liver, it can make blood back up into the anus with hemorrhoids, and it could also do it in the esophagus. You could get uh, swelling in the legs. You could get your your spleen could get really big. So there's kind of a pattern you see with it as well. Hmm. Wow. Fluid. You ever see like an alcoholic might have like a belly that looks pregnant on a man? Yeah. It's just filled with fluid.